All right, this is episode four of our project, a motorcycle engine into a 1970 Honda AN 600. And where we left off last time was with making the differential. This is actually the hardest part of the build, I think. So this is a stock broken Honda 600 engine case uh, one of the spider gears broke on this and it punctured a hole and broke the differential housing which to our advantage was great because we I'll show you here I'll put it side by side cut out the bearing supports um, here and then fitted them to this bracket or apparatus that you see here and this is the main cartridge or should I say feature of our bike build. This is the differential. So I've used the the Honda 600 differential. The spider gears are in here. The CV flanges are here and these are the bearing holders which I cut off of this broken block. This whole unit bolts up in there uh, in the bottom of the car as a cartridge and will allow us service to replace the sprocket when it wears. This is made out of aluminum and they do wear, or change the sprocket to a smaller gear if need be. So uh, we've got a big hole in the bottom of the car. Right there you can see, well maybe you can, can't see because it's dark. And this whole thing is going to go in there. It's going to be adjustable, slide on these slots here. So we could tension the chain or change the tension of the chain should we change the sprocket size. So that is the progress for this week, uh, and I'm happy to say that it's good progress. We are making progress, although it's a bit slow and um, probably not so glamorous because this whole week went into just making this apparatus here to support the differential and make it all hook up. So stay tuned and we'll see what happens next week. Hopefully we can get that thing in there, get it fired up, start driving around although the car needs brakes so I got to get those on order. Okay, thank you for watching.